This is just a short little build video of me uh, modifying a Harbor Freight one ton chain hoist um, to go in a, a, a Unistrut Unistru track and trolley that I've uh, installed uh, on the ceiling of my garage. Um, the, the original uh, chain hoist, you know, you just operate it with a pole chain. Um, it's pretty slow and there's extra chains hangling, uh, just hanging down, uh, dangling around. Um, so I wanted something, you know, a, a little easier to operate, a little cleaner, um, a, you know, a little quicker if I want it to be, but I can still run it slow. Um, so here's the chain hoist um, operating. The, uh, I think the important thing is the, um, the pulley needs to rotate independently of the center axle. You can, you can see me, uh, just a few seconds ago, you can see me kind of rotating it, and you can see the axle, you know, kind of rolling uh, uh, independently. I think that's something to do with the way the mechanism works. So I had to build, like, a little cup to go over that axle to drive the pulley. Um, this, is a, this is just a, a, a Milwaukee drill, a used one that I bought on eBay for, uh, I think, $30.00. Um, a little more than I wanted to pay, but um, but cheap enough that I didn't mind kind of cutting it apart, uh, cutting it in two pieces here, and uh, and connecting the motor and the trigger with a uh, just a, a piece of uh, uh, extension cord. So I have other Milwaukee tools, so I'm always going to have battery packs charged and ready to go for this thing. And that's another thing, having a completely wireless uh, solution was nice. Harbor Freight sells motorized hoists, but then I would have to run an extension cord to it and it wasn't as straightforward for me to mount on the Unistrut trolley. So here I'm, I'm, uh, I'm cutting the um, sort of brackets that fit around the cover that I had cut a hole into earlier. Um, uh, I figured that was a good place to affix the motor so, since I couldn't affix it to the axle. Um, and here's just, just me kind of beefing it up, doubling it up. And here's the demo. There's, there's my 90 pound scooter, a little bit heavy for me to be kind of heaving around onto the work table. So while that hoist is rated for one ton, the Unistrut trolley is rated for uh, five, 600 pounds, I think. Um, so, you know, gonna need to be careful here, um, but should be enough to be helpful for me in the shop.